Hello and welcome back to the Bulba Plays. Uh, Might and Magic 7, Path of Good Playthrough. We had just accepted the two quests from here and rested so that we might travel elsewhere. Traveling today? What can we get in Arathia? We can get the Spy Quest and the Hero Quest. Yeah, sure, why not? And we have Fly now, so we can go clear out the, the area that I've been ignoring with all the Griffins because it's just painful to do until you have fly. <laughs> Go. Doing. Hello, spy. Your next task is somewhat more difficult, more suited for spies than rogues. I've been asked to ensure Watchtower 6, the only tower to survive the recent war against the necromancers, is unable to defend itself the next time it is attacked. <clears throat> Killing the guards inside won't help. They'll just fill it again with more troops. The tower is on the southern edge of the necromancer's land. I want you to slip inside and move a counterweight in the gatehouse at the top of the tower to the gatehouse at the bottom of the tower. It is a heavy weight that can be found in a slot against the wall with a rope tied to it. When the time comes for an attack, the misplaced weights will be noticed too late and the gate will not close. Do this and you will have proven yourself as a spy. Do, do, do. Now are there any skills that we can level you up? Not really, only perception. <laughs> okay, so now we get outside and we go get the <clears throat> the um we go speak to Sir Quixote again. And he tells us about a damsel in distress because defeating a dragon wasn't cliched enough for him. <laughs> Hello, I want to be a hero. I need a hero. I'm pleased to see that you have chosen the path of light. A wrong has been committed, my friends, and who else <clears throat> but us can put it right. A wicked villain has kidnapped a fair maiden by the name of Alice Hargreaves. His name is William Satag, and he has imprisoned her in his tower. You must ride forth to put this villain to the sword and rescue sweet Alice. If you succeed, you will truly be the heroes of the land. And if we go speak to Mr. Dark, Dark Knight guy, he says, Bah, you do good as a worthless. It's impossible to teach you anything. Yeah. Uh, now, is there anything else? I certainly don't need more bottles. So we can go do, 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 do go do this griffin infested area. Do, 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 do. <clears throat> oh, maybe we should cast a chance to hit. And now is when we see the truly most cheaty thing about this <clears throat> is that we can just teleport up and then they're nowhere near us. Cross, look downwards. Turn around and begin shooting again. Also, they can't really keep pace of us during flight mode because flying moves you so much quicker than running. Oi. 
Very good. <clears throat> we can even race the dead bodies down to the ground. Lots of ore up here in these mountains, which we will happily collect. Bah, no dodging, only dying. And then we see who's in this house. I don't think it's anyone that does anything from memory. Oh, fire magic. Yeah, but we don't like fire magic. Aside from torchlight. Torchlight is good. I'll grant you that torchlight is good. And we don't always hate enchant item with fire magic. But other than that, not so much. Okay. Now, where do I want to go next? <laughs> hmm. We probably want to go to Bacada and get the wizard and priest quests if we can. <clears throat> Just thinking, is there anything else? No, I don't think so. Traveling today? Titalia doesn't have any quest bases in it. The coach so we'll, right we'll go do this. Noink. Fly! to go up to Celeste. Which one is it again? Well, I do want to do the School of Sorcery, so let's go do that. I want to become an Archmage. And they say, go to the end of the breeding pit. Or go to the breeding pit in the heart of the Necromancers and go get a book of the Grand Master spell, Divine Intervention, which has been lost to the Necromancers. It's an ill-fated book that manages to get itself disappeared every, every so often. Because, you know, the gods don't want to be too involved in our world. Yes. Now we need to go up into Celeste to get the priest one. Detected money. Money. Mm 
Now, as for Celeste, where are we? Ah, oh, <clears throat> you give us the druid one. Where is Mr. Druid now? No, you. Here we go, the Ranger Lord. Haha, <laughs> it looks like you might be able to do the job I have in mind. The fundamental task a Ranger Lord faces is caring for the land. Recently, poachers have removed the magical gemstone called the Heart of the Forest from the Cerulean Forest. The forest has become restless and attacks those who come too close. The forest blames all walkers for the theft and won't calm down until the stone is returned. Find the stone and return it to the oldest tree, then come back to me. <laughs> Get out of the way. Bodybuilding. Champion! So you want to be a champion, do you? How can you be a champion if you don't win any tournaments? You know, I can't really promote your... You to ch champion status, you have to do it yourself, just like everything else. Go and win five championship tournaments in the arena at night level, and come back to me. I'll call you champions then, should you want. Hello, lots of griffins. Wait, wait. Wait, oh, I must have already had that at some stage that I'm not aware of. Anyway. Lots of potential experience. And we can actually cheat and get at the one that's trying to avoid us by Using the vertical element. God, I wish I had an area of effect spell, though. And I know I was just mocking fire magic, but still. Firebolt alone. Um, fireball alone does not make it a worthwhile. Basically, I just really don't like the master level spells. Immolation is like the one that gives you an aura where things that are near you get damaged is rubbish. Because <clears throat> if you use it, you can't then walk into town because everything gets hurt by you. It's just, yeah, no fun. And it doesn't do enough damage. <laughs> <laughs> More dead bodies. Tasty dead bodies. Thank you. Now we could do that, but how about let's work out which one this is. The one in the corner. Cool. And now we head up to Cloudland. Let's go. And you know what that means? We have a new place to play Arco Mage. Come on <laughs> in, have a drink. This game is actually just Arco Mage Simulator. <clears throat> My wall is 
greater than enemy wall. just grow faster than he can attack. That is useless. is greater than enemy magic. just mostly bad luck. Gave us no walls for a long time. Who hiss. Now a dragon, followed by a dragon, is a good game plan. That was quite a boost. fairly reasonable. We could still use much better boots. So we might go have a look at some boots if they've got any. Yeah, they get pushy once you get over 10k gold. one is that way. <laughs> Priest, and gosh, this is a small text. Whew. Priest, you have come here 
to me seeking that I be your guide on the path to the light, but be warned to learn its ways. You must learn the ways to your own soul. I would suggest that we meditate on this for a while, but you look like you're in a hurry. South of Bricada is an island called Evermorn, and upon that island are the old temples of the sun and moon. Both are inhabited by the remnants of these two religions. They are once proud churches reduced to two old temples fighting for a small island. The Church of the Sun was the founding religion of our current faith, the Path of the Light. I propose we help them out and tip the balance of <clears throat> their current conflict in the favour of the Church of the Sun. Using the map that you were sent to find in order to become priests, convince a sea captain to bring you to the island. There, bring aid and comfort to the Church of the Sun by purifying the altar of the Church of the Moon. This will weaken their cult, and the Church of the Sun will overcome them in battle. Return to me once you have done this. And then there's Light Master. And then there's Empty House. No? I thought you were Empty House. Anyway, uh, there is a... There is something worthwhile over here. <gasps> Obelisk! Okay. Now, is there anything else I want up here? I want to trigger the path of... Shit. Well, let's put an end to that. Uh, we will go back because I do want to get the yoink, onk, no, the path of the light introduction quest done. Jump, jump. That's one nice thing about the pit. You know, you touch the ground on the bits that you're not supposed to walk of and you don't fall out of it. You just suffer a little damage and keep jumping along. Uh, this way has shops, which we're going to go investigate because they might have some black potions that we would like. Hello. Special brew is just for you. What do you have? Pure personality. He probably couldn't use more personality, honestly. Special brew. Just for you. Rejuvenation, pure might, pure personality, stone to flesh. So I've got one pure might, and we could definitely use at least one of them. So let's. These two have got pure might on. I guess we'll go with you. So 22 to 28. 24 to 30, plus 2 damage. Huge, but it's better than a poke in the eye. Uh, and do you maybe have some boots? For a reasonable price. No, that's actually kind of shitty. I expected better from you up here. Oh well. No, no, they aren't. I just said as much. Oh, is this the one with the empty? Yes. Empty houses. Missing game content. <laughs> now he feels memorable for some reason. Hmm. Okay. Little pig, little pig, let me in. Don't remember all of these being here. Hmm. Anyway. The new Lords of Harmondale, I see. Well, I am pleased to meet you at last. I'm sure the relationship between our two governments will be a long and mutually beneficial one. You've made the right choice in allying with us. There is much we need to talk about, but my advisors first insist you walk the wizard's path before our relationship can progress. I know this test, this test seems silly, but I can assure you its purpose is not. You can take the test whenever you feel ready. 
And if you fail today, you can always come back and try another day. And then you ask about it, and it says the test involves entering the front door of the Walls of Mist and exiting through the back. I use the word door loosely. You'll see when you get there. You will not need your weapons. You will fail if you kill any creature that is inside. If you can complete this task, you will be given membership in the Guild of Light. And he is the Grand Master of Light Magic. So now, if we had water to teleport, which we don't, we could go interesting teleport back to the center. But instead, we are left to walk there. <laughs> Good. So we might go get to the start of the Walls of Mist and then call it an episode and do that next episode. In which case, do I go away? Go away. Yes. In which case we're going to want all of our healy type niggy things on. <laughs> yes, we're going to want that. Alright, and then we'll call it an episode. I hope you've enjoyed watching and will join us again soon.